This tutorial will teach you how to use pick and place objects and how to set up your model to rework parts. Create a new frame called Comp Polishing in the Facility Components folder. Add two interface objects to the frame from the Material Flow tab on the toolbox. Add a buffer and two pick and place objects. Add three single proc objects to the frame. Change the orientation of the third single proc by pressing Ctrl R until the desired orientation is reached. Double click the first interface object. Change the name to In. Ensure side is set to left. Double click the second interface object. Change the name to Out. Double click on the buffer. Change the capacity to minus one. This will set the capacity to infinite. The buffer type must be set to Q. Go to the Exit Strategy tab and ensure blocking is checked. Double click on the first single proc. Change the name of the single proc as indicated. Change the processing time to 5 minutes. Insert a setup time of 2 minutes. Go to the Setup tab. Ensure the automatic checkbox is checked. Check the box for after one part. Change the number of parts to 10. This will cause that setup will occur after every 10 parts. Go to the Failures tab and ensure Active is checked. Add a new failure. Ensure Availability checkbox is checked. Change the mean time to repair to 19 minutes. Change Failure Relates To to Operating Time from the drop-down list. Go to the Exit Strategy tab and check the box for blocking. Double click on the second single proc and change the name as indicated. Change the processing time to 10 minutes. Add a setup time of 2 minutes. Go to the Setup tab and ensure the automatic checkbox is checked. Check the box for after the number of parts. Go to the Exit Strategy tab and check the box for blocking. Double click the third single proc and rename as indicated. Change the processing time to 4 minutes. Go to the Exit Strategy tab and check the box for blocking. Double click the Polish ex External Single Proc. 
Go to the Excess Strategy tab. Change the drop-down list to Percentage. Apply the changes. A new tab will appear called Open List. Open the tab. Enter 95 into the first row. Press Enter to create a new row. Enter 5. Apply the changes. Connect all the objects using the connector. Remember to hold down the control key. Double click on the first pick and place object. Open the angles table. Ensure buffer is in row 1 and polish internal is in row 2. Go to the exit strategy tab and ensure blocking is checked. Go to the failures tab and add a new failure. Ensure availability is checked and change mean time to repair to 30 minutes. Change to Operating time. Apply changes. Ensure the active checkbox is checked. Double click on the second pick and place object. Go to the exit strategy tab and ensure blocking is checked. Go to the attributes tab and open the angles table. Ensure polish internals in row 1 and polish external is in row 2. Close all the open frames. Add a new frame under the Test Models folder in the class library. Insert an Events Controller source and drain to the frame. Drag and drop the Comp Polishing frame from the class library onto the new frame. Connect all the objects. Double click on the source. Change the interval to 2 minutes. Set up the events controller. Ensure delete MUs on reset is checked and change the end time to 5 days. Reset and run. Enter the comp polishing frame by double clicking on it. Ensure that the parts move through the line. The orange LED above the single proc indicates that setup is occurring. Select the frame in the Test Models folder of the class library. Press F2 and rename as indicated. Close all the frames and open the Comp Polishing frame from the class library. Select the Rework Single Proc, left click and select Edit Display Panel. Select Active and add a new element. Open the window for value. Scroll down and select Stat Num In. Check Transparent. Apply the changes. This will count the amount of parts that are reworked. Close all the open frames. 
Do you please locate the plant three frame? Select the frame in the class library. Press F2 and rename as indicated. Delete the polishing single proc and replace with the comp polishing frame. Connect the objects. Set up the events controller. Ensure that the parts go through the line. Ensure that the rework count is working.